<coughs> even everybody. Um, Tim has just dropped me off. Um, I got an email a couple of weeks ago to go to a thing that Odin do called uh, Screen Unseen, which you go and watch a film, but you don't know what it is. Um, don't give you any information at all apart from one clue. The clue we received, well, you get more, but the only one I received was um, no ordinary place to work. Um, when tonight, worried that I'd actually be seeing <laughs> Magic Mike. Um, but no, I went to see Inside Out. Highly recommend it. Absolutely brilliant. Um, a film that's going to be characters... A film that is about characters based on emotion. It's going to be a bit of an emotional roller coaster, and it was. Um, you've got anger, joy, um, sadness, disgust, and caution, and how they work together to create the emotions, the humans um, feel and how they figure things out. Um, the story is about a young girl called Riley who is 12 and about these, char these characters inside her. Like I said, they were all emotions. Um, it's a pretty deep film as well. Uh, it's very mature, it's themes. Uh, when I was watching things about when I was watching things in the film, it makes you think about when you were younger and things that you felt and how you were a bit confused and whatever you saw. It's 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 pretty deep, but it's absolutely it's brilliant for the young kids as well. There's lots of jokes there. There's no cheap jokes though for kids. The the kids the laughs that you get the 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 well end, and I think uh, I think the kids will find it absolutely hilarious. It's it's beautiful to look at, but all bright colours and I think I think I think the younger kids will be attracted to it straight away because of the way it is. But for adults, it's everything there for adults. Um, Pixar top form again, probably the best film I'd say since the Toy Story stuff. Um, really, really good, really, really impressive. Um, apparently it doesn't come out here till the 24th of July, I don't think, which is about a month away. Um, but when it comes out, whether you've got kids or not, go and see it. It's well worth it. If you've got kids, take your kids to see it. It's a, it's a, it's a film that you'll really enjoy. Um, a bit more on Screen Unseen. Um, the Screen Unseen is Odeon Cinemas. Um, I got the email, like I said, two weeks ago. You only pay £5 for the ticket. But like I said, you don't know what it is. Um, I didn't find out it was inside out until I got there t tonight. And I was made up when it came up. Because even though it's what people would consider a children's film, I love the Pixar films. Um, even the not-so-good ones, I can sit and enjoy. Um... But yeah, um, just the things to throw in the end. We've had quite a good day, me and Sim today. We went and filmed in our new studio, provided by uh, Paul Machin. Give us a little corner. Paul Machin from the Redmen TV. He's given us somewhere to film for now. So hopefully our videos have more professional look. Um, we're still getting hits on our podcast, our Spider-Man podcast. Uh, which we enjoy doing. So, if you like what we, if you like what we talk about in our videos, you like what I talk about here on Periscope, go and listen to our podcast on Spider Man. It's over on Podomatic, and it's on our um, it's under our Super Nerds UK name. Um, we've also started doing. We had an idea to start doing a uh, bad film commentaries. Um, we start. We've done half of Superman: The Quest for Peace, um, which we had a lot of fun doing. Um, we don't really like the film, so you can imagine what the commentary was like. Um, we were enjoying it, but we're only halfway through because we had other things to do today. 
Um, we've got a video getting put up in the next couple of days that we filmed today at the studio, which is um, our reaction, one more Tim's reaction to what went on at E3. I'm not really a massive gamer. There was a couple of little bits I was interested in, but that, that's more Tim's area of expertise. Um, I just sort of sit there and have a little natter with them, but that's mainly all Tim stuff. Uh, so yeah, we've had quite a productive day today. We've filmed a video, we've started the commentary, we've got a few ideas down for things we want to do in the future. And um, we've been to see Inside Out. Um, and it's, like I said, Inside Out's fantastic. I'd give it 5 out of 5, 10 out of 10, 20 out of 20. It's top, top film. So if you've got kids, go and see it. If you haven't got kids, um, still go and see it. Um, that's me finished really. There's not really much else to say. Um, follow us on SuperNerds underscore UK on Twitter. Go and find our SuperNerds UK Facebook page. Check out our website on www.supernerdsuk.com. We're going to put in an extra page on the website where we're going to put our podcasts, which will be just our podcasts and our bad film commentaries when we get a few more of them. Um, and obviously follow me on Periscope if you've got the Periscope app. Uh, for those two people who've actually sat there and stayed with me for this a little video of me, thanks for staying. One of them was probably Tim. Um, thanks. Um, like I always say, we're inviting suggestions. If there's something you want us to talk about, send us a message, send us a question. We will open to anything. Um, if we know enough about it. We want to make the things that you want to watch. So, uh, thanks for watching and... We'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.